when we got our plans, they came like this in a little nice packet here, plans. The problem was there's 29 of them and they were all folded up, uh, which looks nice. But Caleb and I started thinking, you know, through the duration of five years of shop work and abuse and folding and unfolding and throwing around, these are going to get pretty rattered and tattered. So um, we had an idea. We don't know what other builders do. But what we did to hopefully improve the longevity of the plans and keep them in good shape, we went to Hobby Lobby and we bought a couple things. The idea was we were going to bind it, bind the plans so that we could roll them up, you could put them out on a shop table, they'd stay in order, and they would stay in good shape, hopefully. You know, never done this before. So we got a couple pieces of uh, sanded plywood that we could use as the, the binding. We got a little rod to kind of go as a spacer in between it, that way it would clamp down. So we're gonna glue that down on one side, put that down, it'll pinch our plans together. We've got screws that will go through with wing nuts and then that will provide the clamping force and it will just kind of clamp down on our plans. What's nice about that is we don't have to cut through the plans. If we ever want to remove a single sheet, we can just undo the screws, open the clamp, pull the sheet out, and then pop it back in. We got a piece of plastic to go on the back side, which, thank you Hobby Lobby, was the exact size of our plans, 18 inches by 24 inches. Thank you. And then we also got just a piece of canvas fabric uh, that my lovely wife uh, sewed together for us, double up so it would be nice and thick. And then we also ordered a Bearhawk logo from bearhawkstore.com and uh, she sewed that on there for us. So we took all of this, unfolded the plans, kept them in order, put them in there, took the uh, the two pieces of plywood with a spacer, drilled the holes, clamped it down, and this part's just like a cooking show. You put it in the oven, dun dun dun, <laughs> it comes out. So now we have our rugged set of plans that is bound, it's durable, you know, you can put it on a table, open it up, you know, flip through it. It's nice that, you know, you can move it from shop to garage to house, stays in order, you can read it all, and uh, to transport them, you need to roll them up, put a rubber band around it, and you got yourself a nice, durable, protected, plans binding contraption. And if you get tired of building, or rather when you get tired of building, these plans can be used for other things. You can rig them to block out annoying light. You can have your spuds in the morning with your coffee, right here with your set of plans. You can use them as a shower curtain. When you're hunting bear in Wisconsin and it starts raining, it can keep you dry. You can use them to blow out candles. <laughs> Strike and a miss. <laughs> oh. You can smoke your pipe by the fire while cuddling your plans to keep them warm. You can use them to blow out candles. <laughs> you can sing to your plans. You can use them to blow out candles. Okay, no candles. Okay, we're giving up on the candles. <laughs> no candles. You can play baseball. You can kneel on them while scraping wax off your floor. <laughs>